Hi and welcome. This video will help charities answer question 9 in the 2017 Annual Information Statement. This question asks, what were your charity's main activities in the 2017 reporting period? The question is on page 2 of the 2017 Annual Information Statement. It is important to note that in this question the ACNC is only asking for your charity's main activity or activities, not details about every single thing you do. Also, the ACNC only asks for this information in a very broad sense, so don't stress too much if you find yourself having to be a little general in your response. Information about your main activities can usually be found in your organisation's annual report or on the About section of your website. It is a good idea to have referred to this information or even chatted with your organisation's board or committee about the issue before working through your annual information statement and answering this question. Another handy resource in completing this question is the 2017 Annual Information Statement Guide, easily accessible from the Hub on the ACNC website at www.acnc.gov.au forward slash 2017 AIS. The Annual Information Statement Guide includes extensive support on Question 9 and charity activities, including many listings across a dozen or more charity activity categories. Each listing contains an example of the type of charity activity. We recommend charities which are struggling with this question consult the tables and examples in this part of the guide to help them better specify their main activities. It is also a good idea at this point to settle on which of your charity's activities is most important or most central to your work. Once you have done all this, you can go to the drop down menu next to the words main activity in the online annual information statement. Choose the category your main activity best fits into. Your selection will be saved. If your charity has more than one main activity, select them from the list of tick boxes just below the drop down menu. It is unlikely you will need to select any more than three further main activities. Again, your selection will be saved. There are two more important things to note with this question. Firstly, under the tick box list of possible activities, there is an option labelled Other. When completing past annual information statements, many charities listed activities under the Other category when they could have selected from the options provided. We urge charities to group their activities under the options provided rather than selecting Other. However, if any of your activities are not listed on the annual information statement form, you can select Other. As you can see in the form on the screen, which is of course for a fictitious charity, we have temporarily ticked the other box so you can view the follow-up question which appears. In this box, use one word or phrase to describe your activities. The second important thing to note is that charities that undertake international activities will also be asked to provide some information about this work. In this example, we have pre-highlighted that our fictitious organisation undertakes international activities, so you can see on the screen the extra questions which appear. You will be asked to select one type of international activity from the checkboxes you can see here, and then provide further details here. Then you can save and move to question 10. Remember, if you are unsure about the information you have entered into this section of the Annual Information Statement, you can view and print a preview of your form before you submit it in order to double check your answers or to allow you to consult with your charity's responsible persons. For more on our new form preview option, refer to the how-to video on the topic, located in the Annual Information Statement Hub on the ACNC website. And for assistance with other parts of the 2017 Annual Information Statement, you can view the other videos in this series. As always, if you have any questions or need any specific assistance with the Annual Information Statement, you can call us on 132262 or email us at advice at acnc.gov.au. I hope this has been useful and thanks for watching.